Well, things are messy again. Um, I've been going through trying to get stuff ready for the uh, garage sale, and it's going okay. Um, I kind of got sidetracked and started uh, building the shelves and going through and getting all this stuff taken care of here, which I got to get some more of the panels, the um, the little wood panels that are here. I need to put get two of them out of storage, and then everything else will be done here. So it's just a matter of getting them two little panels. Uh, it's 30 minute, well, about 40 minutes round trip for to get them. And then I can start going through and processing this, which a lot of this is going right up for sale. And uh, some of the things here that's eating up shelf space, I'm going to put on Facebook. With Facebook so far, well, Marketplace has been, not Facebook, but Marketplace, uh, pretty much paying the bills right now. So um, I'm losing money on everything I'm selling, but... You know, I'm getting money back out of the stuff that I was trying to sell. So I'm going to go through and uh, tomorrow I'm having, well, we're having the service for my mom. So I don't know exactly what I'm going to, you know, as far as between now and then if I'm going to make any more videos. But in the meantime, I'm just distracting myself trying to get through all this stuff. And it looks real messy, but this is kind of what you have to do. To go through stuff i mean this is what you end up with halfway through the process because i'm trying to figure out where do i put this where to you know it's like okay i have all this stuff for my office back when i had my you know business which i still have my business but you know i got all this stuff for the office so i'm trying to make a shelf here and that ended up being it right there you know it's like what do i do um so right now i'm just trying to figure out what i'm going to sell what i'm going to keep and that's what this is going to help out so, and then a lot of this is either going to be sold, thrown away, or on the shelf here, which I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to get all this where every shelf's going to have a purpose. So, uh, but I got family coming in today, so I got to get my mom's house ready for them to stay there. And then I got uh, a lot of little things to take care of for the service to make sure everything's good. I got to call them, make sure there's no issues. And then tomorrow we're having a service, so... I probably won't make another video until afterwards. I still don't even 100% know what I'm going to say, but I don't know if I'll be able to say anything because every time I think about it, I just start crying. So, But one of the things, and this is really important, guys. So one of the things that I'm having a dilemma with is I know I want to get rid of like a lot of this excess stuff. You know, I got storage units I'm paying on. I got this warehouse here that I'm paying on. You know and i want to get rid of all of it and i want to have an empty warehouse that i can either choose to get rid of or i can you know repurpose into the next adventure i'm going to go on or what i really you know i know i want to get rid of the stuff that's that's set in stone but once i'm done getting rid of all this stuff that has been buried burying me for the past 10 years you know, it's like, then what do I do? Because I'm so used to being a hoarder. You know, it's like, what am I What am I supposed to do with the next part of my life? I'm turning 50, uh, 50 years old. You know, you're not supposed to be making big life-changing things at this point in my life. Other than retirement. And I sure as hell don't think I can afford retirement right now. I mean, I could, but I really couldn't, you know. But this is my dilemma. This is why I'm very unhappy at the moment. Because, you know, I do want to get rid of the stuff. That's not the problem. But I'm scared or concerned about what do I do after all the stuff is gone. You know, um, I'm trying to figure out, like, who I am as a person. You know, who am I going to become after this? Because I've, you know, I've been a business owner. I've been... You know, a contractor for 25 years before that, you know, I, I did some uh, side hustles. I, you know, when I was in the uh, military, I had a custom car shop and we built cars. You know, I did a lot of things over my life, but I've always been working. And now I'm to a point like, do I want to work? Do I want to go and get me some little BS job somewhere? You know, do I want to hustle flea markets and, you know, buy and sell like I've been doing with that honestly is probably going to be what I do, but you know, it's, it's, it's hard to think about.
you know it's like I really have no idea until I get to the point where I don't have any more stuff but I guess I you know, I got plenty of time to think about it. I don't know why I'm stressing over it now but I am stressing over it I am concerned about what's going to become of you know what's left of my life Am I really overthinking this? I mean, am I taking things way too serious? Yeah. But anyways, right now, sell, sell, sell. That's all That's all I care about. It's just getting rid of stuff and trying to find, you know, it's not necessarily the money, it's but trying to find a home other than the, the landfill for this stuff, you know. But anyways, and I've been working at my mom's house uh, for right now, um... My mom's house is going to be the new studio where I'm going to uh, be selling um, on eBay and stuff, which I moved over some stuff I'm going to sell on eBay and on Poshmark, and I got some mannequins set up, and, you know, so I'm going to kind of get that started and get that worked on. Um, but it's kind of hard also, you know, of having to move my mom's stuff and then kind of replace it with mine, and it's a lot. So it's a whole lot to deal with so but I'm just trying to stay busy and keep my mind off of it but then again I'm going right back to you know ground zero of all my memories since 1977 so but anyways if you uh if you have any enlightenment that kind of help me how to you know figure out what I'm supposed to be doing any words of wisdom I can greatly uh appreciate it or use it if uh you know, but a lot of people also, you know, don't know the whole story behind the scenes because I haven't told you guys the whole story behind the scenes. But anyways, I, I am going to have a garage sale this Friday. I don't know how good it's going to be, but um, I have like seven boxes of merchandise uh, that I'm going to go through. And it's like just random stuff, but, you know, some of it's household, some of it. Here, I'll just, this is, here, let's just do this tote here. So, what is in this tote? I know it was heavy. So, yeah. So, there's yeah, some tools, an Xbox. You know, this is just, I don't know. I mean, hell, I got plenty of stuff. Anyways, that's it for now. I'm going to go to my mom's house and clean up and get some things taken care of over there. Which, for the most part, is clean. But I just want to double check. So, Oh, God, I got way too much stuff. Peace, love, money, I'm out.